my pretties, it's me, the Lion Queen. Welcome to, well, my year 2020 free in review, which is basically going to be me talking about, you know, this year, 2020 free, letting you guys know how it went, what my favorite part was, what I did like about it, what I didn't like about it, etc. So in this case, I am going to say right now that the good news about this year is that any drama that I had with certain people has been already solved and solved this year, which I'm thankful for. But it wasn't solved until sometime in August, like early August of this year, just before my birthday, which honestly, that's a blessing because 2022 drama was hectic in hell. I'm not going to go into detail on that because, well... You know, I'm just, I'm not going to get into detail on that because, well, for one thing, this video is not going to be about drama. This video is going to be no drama talk whatsoever. However, I will say some people have apologized for what they did, you know, in regards to who was, you know, involved in the whole drama that went on last year that I went through. And again, I'm not going to go into detail on that because this video is... Not 2022, because that year was garbage. We're talking about 2023. This year to me was very much better than last year. It was so much better than last year. There wasn't any drama or anything like that to which I'm grateful for. Because in all due reality, this year has been so much better. I mean, you know, I'll talk about every month in bits and pieces. But if I go into full-blown detail about what I've actually happened to me, the whole video itself would have been an hour long at least. So I'm going to go ahead and basically talk about, you know, what the positive side of things because, you know, this is not all negative because of the fact that, you know, we're in 2023. My whole, most of this year was, was pretty much, um, well, it had its ups and downs like everything else. Like, like with most people, when it comes to certain years, they had their ups and downs. Like whatever, you know, something bad happened, something good happened, something that happened in between, etc. So, I'm going to basically go ahead and explain about this year. So, yeah. And I am going to say right now that, you know, this year I could definitely say that a lot of people agree with me was definitely better than last year. This year was so much better than last year because last year there was not a lot of good last year. There was just so much um, drama and, well, mainly internet drama. Like, there was internet drama left, right, and center. This year, on the other hand, was definitely better than how last year was. So I can definitely say this, this year was definitely better. I got to do some activities such as I got go on my mini vacation, which that's something I got to do in, um, well, in May. I also got to do horseback riding this summer, which is fantastic. And I do have plans to do it all again, which I will be talking about my plans for 2024 in another video, which I will talk about um, my plans for 2024, which I'll talk about that in another video. Because this is not the right video for them. So this is basically me talking about, you know, how 2020 me free was. Well, it's definitely better. I mean, I still had some ups and downs. Whatever it be, I got into some arguments or some, you know, stuff went downhill with things. But anyway, I am managed to hold myself together and got through this year. Just like how I did with last year. Now, I know for a fact this is going to be uploaded sometime in, I guess, I'm not really exactly sure the exact date, but sometime in um, December. But it might be, well, yeah, sometime in December it'll be out by sometime in December, which will be around before Christmas, so, like, before the holidays. So that way people will get to see, you know, how this year is. Because I will admit that last year we had so much negative. I think it was like negative energy and stuff. And that honestly really didn't do great on my mental state. And, and it really happens to suck for a lot of people. Because, you know, 2022 was really bad because of the internet drama and some other shit too that went downhill. But 
we had some good moments here and there and last in 2022, but you know, this year we had a lot more good than we ever did than last year. Cause if you remember back in 2020, that was the worst year ever because of the pandemic and, you know, some other stuff that happened, which I'm not going to go into detail on that because it's none, because it's pretty much just dead. Like 2020, um, 2020 drama is pretty much dead to me. And I'm not going to go into detail about it because, you know, like I said, the video would be too long. And plus this is not the right video for drama. I don't, um, I don't have drama regarding in my videos and that. Cause you know, you know, who doesn't like, who likes drama, you know? Nobody does. So, with that being said and stated, uh, despite my mom having a bad fall, um, this, um, well, you know, this, um, yeah, near the end of September and throughout October, so she couldn't drive for a while, but the time I'm going, by the time this gets uploaded, she'll be doing much better and she'll be able to drive again, which... You know, I'm just still thinking of positive thoughts, not saying she won't get better or anything because, you know, that's just me thinking so negative. But at the same time, I was upset, so there's that. But, you know, she'll be she'll be better by the time this gets uploaded to YouTube. And anyway, with that being said, when it comes to even negative energy or negative um, stuff that happens... Just don't think so negative on those thoughts, you know. Think of something, like, positive that you can get through at the end of the day. Like, if you're having a really rough day, think of something positive that will help you get through the day. I mean, that's what I at least try to do whenever I'm feeling down or not really doing the best. But, you know, my birthday this year was definitely better than last year. Because if you remember last year, um, on my birthday last year... I did get harassed by cer by some people, which I'm not going to name any names on who went after me because I don't want any chaos from last year reawakening or people starting drama again. So, yeah, that's why I'm saying I'm not going to say names on who went after me or something. Because, you know, last year drama is pretty much history. And, yeah, I basically could pretty much care less if that makes any sense. So, and if you're part of me, if you're hearing, you know, an Xbox controller going on, I'm kind of playing a video game as I'm recording this, so there's definitely that. So, with that being said, what did I personally have to say about the, some of the good stuff that happened? Well, for one, I got to go horseback riding, which is um, pretty awesome. Awesome in my opinion, so I was able to, you know, go riding. I couldn't do it last year because I had some, you know, vehicle problems and, um, well, personal problems too. So, I'm, they're mostly personal, so I'm just not going to go into detail about it. But there's definitely that, and it did play a part in last year. But this year, things got better, and, you know, well, I'm still struggling with, you know, health pro not health problems, but, like, life problems, like life personal problems, I'm still pushing through it, I'm still getting by every day, I'm still doing what I love to do, because it's pretty much therapy for me in the internet, like it's personal, no, well not really personal, but anything personal I have going on, this is pretty much my therapy to get off of, you know, my real life problems and just focus on doing what I love doing, and you know, it's really awesome how, you know, as I'm recording this, I'm like almost at 5k subscribers, which is amazing. And I'm probably going to get be probably been probably get up there by the time I upload this or I may not get 5k subs till 2024. So if we can get up to 5k subs um this year, if we haven't got up there already, or, if not, we'll even make it as a goal for 2024, is to get up to 5k subs. Like, to be fair, I never expected to grow so much. In, as in, you know, grow in subscriber count so quickly. Like, I mean, like, I mean, ever since that drama was over and stuff, um, my sub count has been getting bigger every time. Which, honestly... 
is surprising. But I'm still really, really glad that, that, that any drama that I went through has been solved and over with. Because, you know, nobody wants to, you know, remember drama. Nobody wants to go through any kind of drama. Whatever it be with said people or said person. It could be anyone, really. Now, what did I personally think? Well, January usually was like a really cold, long month, you know, that kind of thing. Because everyone knows January is one of the longest months, one of the most coldest months of the year, and as well as, you know, the hardest month to get through. But, you know, February is where things start to ease up a little bit and get better, a bit like a... You know, because they always say, you know, no, um, oh yeah, January is usually the hardest month to get through, but in February, that's when things start to get a little easier, which they have gotten easier, and then, um, March, nothing really happened, but, you know, it was my boyfriend's birthday, and then Space Voyager had his birthday, so there's that, um, April, we had Easter, which was pretty fun. May, I had my mini vacation. It was Mother's Day, which I did get to do that. I got to see my dad on in May, which was nice because I hadn't seen him in so long. And, and another thing I would like to add is that, what was it? Oh, yeah. And then we had um, June, which I started horseback riding again. Went back to that one barn that I hadn't been to in a few years because of the fact that I had, you know... Um, some personal no issues going on. I couldn't do riding for a while, so I had to pretty much take a year off from riding just to, um, you know, try and work something out what I was going through. I'm not going to go into detail on that because it's just personal. So there's definitely that. But, you know, in July I went riding some more and same with August. Um... August happened to be my birthday, which is fantastic. So I got to go riding on my birthday. And and another thing I like to do is I also got to um, do some more stuff. Which in September, um, I got into more stuff, which is awesome. And I also got to... To, you know, I also got to celebrate my mom's birthday. And unfortunately, that was the same month where my mom, unfortunately, had a pretty bad fall. But she did get um back up in the, you know, and the, by the time I'm uploading this, she's doing much better. And she's not in so much pain, but she's still in pain regardless, though. So, yeah. But another thing I really have to say is that... um. I do appreciate you guys for the for this year, you know, sticking with me, making sure I'm okay, and, you know, just making sure that, you know, I'm happy and pretty much just sticking around, supporting me throughout the hard times I went through, stuff like that. I also want to point out this and right now that I do appreciate the, um, the fun times uh, the channel had, and on Halloween... Went very well. I got about 50 um, free, well, yeah, 50 free kids at my door, which was a little more than I expected to get. But it was still pretty amazing how I got that many um, kids at my door on Halloween. So that's going to mean I'm going to have to stock up on more candy for next year. So, anyways, with that being the case and with that being said, I'm going to sit here. And just um, say right now that, um, yeah, that November went very well. I got Christmas stuff out and stuff. And now that we're in December, we are looking forward to the Christmas holidays. And we are going to be, you know, you know, having a good Hanukkah, Christmas, Kwanzaa, wherever holiday you celebrate around this time of year. I mean, we're also going to, you know, stay strong for this channel and for each other and for everybody else who may be struggling. And to anybody who is struggling with personal issues or life issues, I want to sit here and say something. There is more people in the world that have are, are having issues much worse than you guys are. 
So if you think you're alone in this one, you're not alone. Because there's plenty of other people that are just, you know, having a, just issues just as bad as bad as you are. So don't you think you're alone. In any ways, in any ways, um, everything's all set and ready to go for 2024. I want to sit there and say this right now that everything's all good and ready to go for 2024. Um, what do you guys think that is going to happen this year? Well, you guys can let me know what the, what it is in the comments below. And you guys can let me know how was 2023 for you guys. Like, I mean, was it good for you? Was it bad? Was it not so amazing? Let me guys, let me get, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Because I personally would like to hear what you guys think on it, thoughts on it. For me this year... I know there was some outside internet drama in my community w involving some of my fans having issues with said people. Or, well, not the said people I had issues with last, um, with last year, but different people. I didn't get involved in that drama, which is good. I just ignored it. I mean, I'm not, you know, going to take action or something unless it's necessary. But at the same time, I just, I just focus on my own thing. I don't bother... With drama anymore. Because drama 2022 is history. And you know. It's just really something I don't understand. Why people are into that. I have no idea. But yeah. I guess with that being said. And that being the case. I'm just going to sit here and just say right now. That this is just simply. You know a video just to let you guys know. How this year was going well for me and stuff. So if you happen. To be new to my channel. And if you're interested in, you know, um, subscribing to this channel, you're more than welcome to do so. You can comment if you want. If you even want to press um, the notification bell to when I upload, so that way you guys will not miss an upload, you're more than welcome to do so. And as always, um, if you want to go follow me on Twitter, DeviantArt, and stuff like that, you're more than welcome to do so. Also, if you are interested in subscribing to my backup channel, known as Miss Dark Shigo, Link to that will also be in the about page section. So you guys can go subscribe to my backup if you haven't. Now anyways guys, I mean I'm kind of wrapping up this video. You know, because I just want to send out positive vibes to everybody. Who may be struggling with you know personal issues. Or even um, mental health issues or whatever it may seem to be. Just so you know you're not alone when it comes to you know trying to... Drive through places. Don't think you're alone because you're not alone. Everybody else has gone through what you went through or is going through it. So, I guess with that being said, let me know what your how your 2023 was for you guys. And as always, I will be catching you guys in the next video. So, if there's anything I'm missing, let me know what it is in the comments below. So, as always, I'll be seeing you guys all in the next video. Peace out. And like always... Roll the outro because I'm out.